Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Trufin at the Babbling Belgian, and this is still The Last of Us Part 2. We're at the TV station, but um, yeah, things are not, not really happy. There's a lot of people strung up here um, and gutted to boot. So the guts are hanging out. I'm just gonna look the other way because that is hor horrible. Um, there is this special symbol and the ladies already noted that they don't believe that this was Tommy. Um, I mean, I, I, I hope so that it's not Tommy. He could have done this, maybe, if he was really, really mad, but it doesn't seem like his style. This seems to be a bit too ritualistic. Um, I kind of have the feeling that we're dealing with another faction here then, someone that's not so keen on the WLF as well, because I'm assuming these are WLF members. And now we can actually, in well, investigate the mark. Is that graffiti again? Okay. Who are these guys? Someone else the WLF fucked with. Probably. Oh, fucking deranged. And they probably have a larger group than just Tommy. Which would explain how they could take over this entire building by themselves. But again, this makes this a building where there's nobody else. Uh, well, not, not at the moment at least. There's uh, a few more bits and pieces over here. Ooh, that was 15 crafting materials. Don't mind if I take that. Because um, I've been putting a lot into a gun that I don't really use. But this is... I don't want to drop those bodies, actually. <laughs> I'm just going to keep keep them hanging there. This is horrifying. There's a few areas we can check out. And that mark is also on the desk here. Which actually is really, well, cool in a creepy way. Because that allowed the corpses to see the, the bodies, to see the mark from where they were hanging. So that is... Absolutely grotesque. Um, I, of course, see see the stairs up going up, but before we do that, I might as well check out this little side area. Okay, so since there's nothing here, let's just take one of the stairs up now. Oh, gold. Um, yeah, this isn't this isn't fun, is it? There's a lot of the offices up here, and a few more. Health kits, although, I mean, I haven't been hit since uh, one of our final encounters with humans. So that's good. We're actually learning how to play the game a little bit better. We're not getting hit as much. And we're getting a lot of crafting materials. Yeah, we're pretty much full on a lot of things. Which is also a good position to be in. Um, ooh. We can actually slip through there if we want to. I'm just going to quickly check the other side here. Well, there is ammo lying around, and ammo, I'm assuming the the limit, so yeah, I'm at the other side of that, that gap. The limit on ammo is pretty high, considering Ellie's wearing a backpack. We can definitely store some ammo in the backpack. But yeah, this is... I'm really curious, I mean, I'm very interested now that they're introducing yet another faction. And it seems to be not a very friendly one, but that... Wait, is that... That's a gun! Gimme, 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 there we go. Long rifle bullets. So if I swap that out, how much do I have? So that's five in total, but I can reload this thing. So it actually holds three bullets. Um, and then swap over to the shotgun. Because I feel like the shotgun might be a little bit more handy in a pinch. And then the silenced pistol, just in case we uh, come across anything we need to shoot in the face. But in a quiet way. But other than that, this place seems quiet again. So there's a little bit more ammo. And as meticulous as I am, I'm just going to reload my gun to have the, those seven bullets in the clip. But that seems to be it. And that means that we go out of the building again. This doesn't make any... Oh, God. We're going to have to shimmy. Because this door isn't going to be open. Shit. Yup. Okay. Another body up there. Wait, where? I don't like this. Wait, where? Exposed. We have to search all of it. I want to find Leah. Just be careful. Uh, aren't you joining? Watch your step here. Nina? 
much. Is she? Oh, she is, apparently. This seems like uh, one of the big guys' office. That's a, a classic. Or oh, horse. There's a lot of uh, CEOs with uh, images of horses in the ooh in their office. This is yeah. It gives the game kind of a weird vibe sometimes that we're going through all of these areas where everything, everybody's already dead. Even though this is supposed to be a revenge story, everybody's already dead. Every time we come across something. Another shotgun shell. That's a door we can open. What's all? No, 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 no. I just want to check things out before we go. I didn't touch that glass. That wasn't me. It was already broken when I got there. I mean, some of them were shot with bows and arrows. So that might indicate that it was Tommy. And then we have another trading card. Kimimela trading cards. Okay, I, I mean I can check those out, but it's just it's it's a, a a woman with animals that is good for her. Okay, I should probably check out the cards because the cards actually look quite nice, even though I'm not reading the full description anymore. The cards actually look pretty cool. So let's open this up. Okay, so that's the other side of that staircase. And are we gonna face whoever was in here? Because I feel like we would have heard something by now. Oh, gold. Well, it's consistent that everybody's still dead. You hear that? Yeah, yeah, I hear that. What is that? I should probably check that last, right? Because, uh, yeah, resources take preference here. There's more alcohol on this guy's desk. And a note. Right next to a sleeping bag on the couch. Rue. A little bird told me those scars you brought in from the coast talked. I heard Isaac is quite impressed with you. I know you've been having doubts, but you've got to power through right now. Show him what happened at the coast wasn't a one-off. Ah, show him what happened at the coast wasn't a one-off and you'll be set for life. Think about how few people get this chance. I'm proud of you, Dad. So that's a note to... A wolf but they were talking about scars so that's probably the other faction again with the ammo cases I hate you guys give me just a few full clips that would be really really nice and anyway, yeah I don't need to open up that door and um, the spills over here definitely gonna grab all of that and some more living quarters so they definitely use this as a base of operations as well because there's a lot of uh, sleeping areas around here at the top level. Is there something over here? Yep, another revolver. Bullet. And then, this is probably gonna be plots. There we go. There's another woman. Ah, uh, yeah, that's her. That's her. Yep. I'm not gonna get anything yeah. out of her. You sure? Yes. Guess the universe really wanted her dead, huh? And I'm assuming that the scars are probably using bows and arrows. There's nothing on her. And there's a large duffel bag underneath the bed. Might as well grab that. This is two. Do you copy? Six. Acknowledge. Over. Dina. Hmm. That's all of them. Hi, wait. That's New Jackson. Look at their fucking smiles. That's her. Yeah, that's all good. So, by the way, I don't think the WLF is necessarily evil. Well, she's dead. 
Like so many factions feel? in this game? I'm pissed we couldn't talk to her. Yeah. She didn't hurt John. She traveled hundreds of miles to torture him. I don't care whether she held the club or not. I get it. The big question, the big motivator is gonna be why. Up. Look over Leah's stuff. For sure. Let's head deeper into downtown. We can find a building to secure. Um, yeah, we could. But yeah, as I said, I don't think the WLF are evil necessarily. They're just another group of people trying to defend themselves and their people. Um, they're a bit harsher than the people at Jackson because they seem to be pretty friendly towards newcomers. Oh, crap. Um, can't we just jump down? How are we getting out of here? Can't we just drop down? On me. No. Okay. I'm gonna have to find a way out of this. So there's at least three of them. And we know there's a bunch of staircases all over the place, so even holding up next to a staircase isn't gonna help. So there's one moving to the right here. There we go. That's one down. On the staircase behind them. Where is the, the guy that's pulling me? Come on, Dina, out of the fucking way again. Um. Oh, damn it. Ah, crap. That's gonna be bad. She's doing well. In here! That's that. And where's the rest of them? Need to, need to keep an eye out. Yeah, okay, so there's one over there. And there we go. Ah, the strike to the face. There's the last one. Oh, there's the last one. There's the last one. There we go. That was the silencer. Gone. Wait, that's this is not over, is it? Still standing. Okay. I don't think so. Whew. Um, there was, there was health around here, I think. Um, I'm gonna have to move a little bit fast. Yeah, there was a, a snack bar over here. So this thing, there we go. That gets us to half health again, at least. Now, um, bricks. Is there a brick somewhere? There's more of them on the way. Are there actually, or are you just saying that to hurry me along? Is there something? Ah, oh, I can swap. There's a hammer, there's a machete. The machete is nice. The machete actually has seven charges. That sounds like a very good deal, doesn't it? Uh, I'm also gonna heal up. Do I heal up? Yeah, I'm gonna heal up. Up to full. Do I swap for the machete? I could. I don't know. Doesn't seem like there are more enemies coming. I mean, I have the adhesive if I want to make another one, so I'm just gonna swap for the. Oh no! Wow, that was very enthusiastic. There we go, machete, and we can actually craft that into something better still. So that's really, really good. Okay, Dina, lead the way. I would say. Um, although I do like. Is there another bottle around here or something? There we go. Another bottle. These bottles are really good. Bottles are good for killing. Killing people. Adina, for fuck's sake. Push in! You got it! Um, I think I'm gonna swap for the long gun. Are they coming up, or what the hell is going on? 
What the hell is going on? I mean, they're yelling, but where are they? <laughs> I have a, a supernatural listening mode. Oh, they're up there. Ow! Why? How? How did they already spot me? That was bullshit. Wait, what? You you already shot at me, that Keep it up! Oh fuck. Ow. Ow. I'm just gonna swap. Okay. Let's just run then. Ow. Okay. There, we just needed to run. That was not clear. Okay, let's just stay low. I mean, we're little girls. Ooh, ooh, ah, ooh, ooh. Oh shit! Okay, they can't shoot for shit all of a sudden. Oh, this is gonna be no good, is it? It'll work for now. Um, Keep going. But where are we now? Oh, this is some. Masks. Yeah, this isn't okay. good, is it? This... Well... I don't think they'll find us here. Oof. Damn, what are we doing here? I'm running away, I know, but still... Oh, God. Well, this just took a turn again. Um, so, yeah, the... the they did confirm that the scars are actually the old faction. That is, yeah, so that's showing you how the spores grow out of the corpses. As for once there's a corpse in there. Um, ooh, there's multiple corpses in here. It's been a while since anybody's in here. Probably. That's another very big pile of flesh. And that, yeah, you know what? I can make another health kit. We've gathered enough resources, and we can grab those rags as well. Okay. Okay. Underground, evil, sewer place. Although I still don't know the, the particulars of the infected. I know. Because it's clear that the infected also need to feed somehow, because they fed on the horse, and they're eating humans as well. So, if that's the case, how would they survive down here? If there's no meat whatsoever. Oh, this is... But I mean, even if it knew where we are... Um, can we just move? Because, yeah. Oh, this is gonna... Oh, wow. Oh, this is interesting. Did she turn off the flashlight? Okay, so there's clickers and fucking. Can we actually use a bottle to? <laughs> distract the clickers towards them. There we go. <laughs> okay, that was that was great. So I still had a bottle. These guys are gonna eat it. Let's just stay behind here. Okay, that was surprisingly effective. Look at that. This is just chaos. I have done a horrible thing. I've killed all these people. I'm just gonna go into the, the thing for. Oh god. Wow. Okay, I'm just gonna. There's a lot of clickers in here, by the way. And um, do I still have a bomb? I should probably. I, I still have a bomb, right? 
I'm just gonna put that over here just in case any of those guys want to come over here I'll just stay in the back and see whatever happens because these guys I mean they're running around with the clickers at their on their asses <laughs> and I don't want to shoot look at them running around I think both of them have two clickers behind them are they gonna keep doing this because this might actually take a while this is I think they're doing circles right now <laughs> this is well this is oh no there he goes there he goes and there's there's one clicker and there's two clickers okay I think I think it just got the last guy so there's three more clickers available I'm just gonna grab the bomb and now I'm gonna put that over here And maybe I can take out the one in the back. Alright, there with a long shot. Or maybe I shouldn't. There we go, there goes one, and this one is gonna run straight into the bone. There he goes. And then this guy. Oh, fuck. Okay, I ran out of ammo. Okay, he died. Okay. 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 Kind of flubbed on that final pistol. We shouldn't hang out here for too long. No. We shouldn't. Grab what you can. And then let's move. Wow. That was a really cool set piece. The fact that you could just set them up against each other. That was really, really funny. Um, but yeah, I think I killed most of them indirectly. Well, I killed all the humans indirectly. I'm just going to scrounge around a little bit. I hear a lot more clickers, but I don't think they're actually here. Guess we'll see. Okay, aside from a bunch of bullets on the left side there, it doesn't seem like there's that much extra stuff around here. So I am going to now have to move through the train it still sounds like it's clicker central out there but i haven't spotted a single extra clicker anymore so i think we killed all the humans with the clickers and the clickers are still happily running around the place i should probably move through the train there we go so we can grab all of that do i already use i think i should probably i think i'm gonna upgrade my Weapon, yeah, because I can grab the extra adhesive immediately, so that's not a problem. And we've upgraded that with a new blade, so that's good. Now, more explosive stuff, and I'm still holding a brick, which is also good. So, our troubles have been replenished, so we're back to killing in this red glow. This, uh this doesn't sound good, does it? Because it's still... <laughs> the background noise at the moment is horrifying. I don't know if I want to open up the door. Where did they, those guys actually come from? What's that light? Is that just... Dina. Yeah, it's Dina's reflection. Okay. So let's... Um... Oh, this something is going to jump out of that. Okay, yeah, yeah, I'm moving it. And just close it. Hi! Oh, shit! Well, I, I don't know if this is any better, by the way. Yeah. Now we're inside okay. of the train cart. Yeah. Oh, this is claustrophobic. Thanks. Babe. I'm really tired. Yeah. I don't blame you. Yeah, let's get out of here. I uh, do not blame you. Because we, I mean, even though we just got out of that fight pretty easily, because we, I mean, we killed the humans with the clickers. Uh, every time I need to go through something, I'm gonna turn on the flashlight. So you guys see something as well. Um, okay, so there's more pills over here. How are, how are we doing pill-wise? 42, so I want to go... Ooh, improve silences. Might as well do that, because the fastest stealth kills is the big ticket here. 
So there we go, improved silencers. So if we wanted to, we can make one right now. It's two and two. Ah, oh, we could have two bombs of everything aside from the normal, well, the proximity bomb. I should probably make another one of those because those are really, really handy. So let's just do that. There we go. And I'll keep the silencer. Uh, well, I don't need the silencer right now because I only have two, uh, two ammo in the pistol. And it is always for the pistol, as I understand it, so... Nothing I can do about that. Hi. Hi. Um, don't mind me, just keep sleeping if you want to. And there's more pills over here. Ooh. Ooh. Maybe through here. Lots of stuff. And then we get a note for jewels. Let's flip that over. Ooh, that's a lot of stuff. I hope you made it out and find this. The two of us got into a minor dust up with some clickers, but we're still in one piece. Hold up here for the night to lick our wounds. The long dead body of a man watched over us, a gruesome reminder of why we're doing this. This infection, it really was a warning. Better to live off the land and remain in this rotting mess. Zachary says if we keep heading north, we'll hit the Seraphite encampment in the next couple days. He calls it Haven and they build it all themselves. Hearing them talk about it, it was hard not to get inspired, even optimistic. I pray for your safety, I hate to think of what Isaac will do if his goons catch you. I'll be holding my breath, waiting for a sign that you're okay. Grey. Okay, so the jewels. Jewels and Grey, and we had um, Rebecca and Fran, I think. It was another couple that we saw, we saw multiple uh, notes about already. Oh, why? Why? Did you hear what they kept calling us? Scars. I wonder if that's who made all those murals. And gutted all those wolves. Everyone in this city's a fucking psycho. No shit. Okay, we're gonna have to crawl underneath the train car. There's an opening down here. Is that Dina or is that... No, it's Dina, okay. Uh, this... Okay, so the WLF is screaming on the top of their lungs. Let's not walk into the water, because this is going to suck. Oh, crap. Why are we in the sewers? This isn't Resident Evil. Dina, will you get out of the water, please? Okay. Well, this is... Um, that was... Yeah, we just saw her twitch a little bit. Um, let's grab the revolver ammo and then... Wait a second. She's burned. Or he's burned? Jesus. Have you ever seen anything like this? Bloaters have acid spores. But that didn't sound like a bloater. Um, Whatever the fuck they're fighting, we should let them kill each other. Agreed. That, I mean, that did sound like um, um, a flamethrower. That noise we heard after the screaming was like a... <laughs> yeah, that's going to sound great in the microphone. Um, but yeah, probably that. Ooh, there's a ladder here. I can... What, what are we even looking at? Got Ooh. another ladder across there. Okay. But how is the electricity going to help us here? Yeah, I'm just gonna open up Some way over there. this door here. Ooh, this is probably I should have probably been quiet. No, okay, this seems to be fine. This is another workbench. And we have more materials over here, so that is all okay. Slam the door on Dina. Sorry, Dina. Sorry, let's see. Because I think we might be able to finish up with the upgrades on the No, I can't get the scope on the bolt action rifle. So might as well just uh, the fire rate. I hate to do the fire rate on the normal pistol. I think I'm gonna save up for the damage uh, on the yeah over here. So that's 70 we need for the damage increase on the revolver. So that's plus 40% damage accuracy, uh, damage and 25% uh, accuracy. That's gonna be really good. But I need three more parts to do that. So let's just hold off on that. Damage upgrade should probably take priority here. And we filled up the revolver with that ammo and there's nothing left here. No extra parts that I could use. No, 
Doesn't seem like it. And now we can actually toss that over. Because it just counts as a rope. That'll do. And then I can do this. And uh, oh no 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 no! What was the button again? I needed to hold the button if I wanted to swing. How how do I swing again? R one, thank you, game. There we go. And back and forth and jump off. There we go. Thank you for reminding me of the controls. Um, there is another door here, and the ladder doesn't seem broken. Yeah. Damn it. This isn't going to do much, is it? I'm just going to sneak and then open up the door. Because this seems to be another little area. Should probably just reload the pistol and be done with it. Grab the brick. And now what? Because, I mean... Look, look at this vent. Oh. Is there something in the room that I missed? Might be. I like to be meticulous, but... Um, oh, yeah, okay. Got it. Thank you, Dina. Good idea. What's this? Okay, so there's a little side area. Here. I got you! I got you! Okay. Holy fuck. A shambler. That just. I've never seen one of those. That just blew up. Me neither. It blew up, but then kept going. So a shambler must be another stage then in between um, clickers and bloaters. Oh, gold. I don't know how these guys work though. Dina, can you turn off the light? I don't know if bloaters are actually blind or not. They seem to use the same tactics. Okay. I can't seem to... Oh, uh, I think I'm... I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm gonna die. That was horrifying. So, I don't think you can sneak attack Br Shamblers, was it? Okay, in fact it will not see your flashlight. Ah, okay, thanks Thanks for telling me that now. Fuck, there's another one. I don't know how these guys work. Because I couldn't sneak attack him. They do look horrifying though, but I can't... No, I can't grab him, so... Watch out! Oh crap, okay, that didn't do anything. Okay, so I did get a hidden... Oh god! Oh, I got back in... Yeah, okay. So the clouds are... Shouldn't go into the clouds. And there we go. So that worked. So I need to get out of the clouds. Okay. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Okay, so that was a way of dealing with them. Not that that was perfect, but at least they're dead. Ugh. Fuck these assholes. Wow. Okay. Did they get you? No, I'm clean. Okay, so. Shamblers? Is that what they called them? Yeah. Where the hell do shamblers come from? I don't fucking know. But they're disgusting. And apparently we can write something down about those. Might as well uh, take a look at the journal then. 
Um, Shambler, now are there new infected? Yeah, that's a pretty apt drawing. Okay. Dan. Oh, look at those acid burns. No, I'm good. Yeah, it's not good, is it? Um, so, one new thing I learned. You can actually... Um, the, the, the infected do not see your flashlight, apparently. Because <laughs> I've been turning that off every five seconds because I was afraid that... Um, yeah, they were going to spot the flashlight, but apparently that's not a problem. Um, there's more supplies where that came from. I should probably use bombs when it comes to shamblers. That's probably the tactic you could use. I didn't do that just yet, but... The first one I actually killed with a melee strike, then hitting him with a brick and then melee striking him again. That seemed to be enough to kill it. But then yeah, the second one took uh, multiple headshots, if you could count it as a hat and then a few shotgun blasts. Yeah, but this guy I could kill... Oh wow, look at how the face distorted. <laughs> Grew apart like that. That is horrifying. I'm just checking out the rest of the area where we just run through everything. Um, just to see if there are any other supplies around here. I don't think there will be. Ooh. Emergency maintenance only. Please follow all new FEDRA protocols. Your supervisor will have all the latest up-to-date manuals and safety information. Okay. Good for them, but it apparently didn't really work out. Okay, now that we've killed all of them and cleared let's out the place. Let's clear this up. And remember that we have more tools than just shooting and hitting people. Can you uh, time. hold that up? Almost done. Um, okay. Will that be up? Nope, it will not. There we go. So now it's pretty loud. Yeah, it was pretty loud. Okay. Whew. I'm uh, I'm about ready to get out of the sewers. As far as I can see. Ooh. Good. Ooh. There we go. More rags. Shamblers. As if the others weren't bad enough. Guess that's nature for you. Yeah. Well, nature's an asshole. Well, evolution is an asshole, I would say. Because it's a, a pretty nice uh, defense mechanism. This seems to keep going, but... There is another door to the side here that we can actually... Open up. Ah, uh, we get another playing card. Dr. Daniela Star. Might as well check that out. Okay, there we go. Future Alliance. Home to Earth. I have no idea how to play that game. And I will probably never get a clue on how to play that game. Because it's just collectibles. But uh, that seems to be the... Ooh, never mind. Nine more parts so we can upgrade the revolver if you want to. Well, once we come across another uh, workbench, that is. Um, this door wasn't open, so I'm guessing Dina just opened that up. Is that...? Uh... Hey. Doesn't this look like the lady from the scar graffiti? Oh. Yeah. So that's why it's called why the scars. Why do you call them scars? After the shit we saw today, I'm not sure I want to find out. So we saw that uh, picture of a woman before. Um... And she had a scar in her face. We can actually grab those. There we go. And we're almost back to full now. So I didn't have to spend a... Spend a health kit on that. So that's really nice. Uh, that's probably... That seemed like an empty can. Inside of that. And we can get a little scrap of newspaper. Hey Dewey forgot the code again. Get me a soda and the code is yours. Okay. What's this? Military forces were surprised yesterday to discover the whole community alive and well. While the surrounding neighborhoods were entirely overrun with victims of the cordyceps infection that's been ravaging the nation, these survivors had managed to keep their streets and homes clear all by themselves for the past six months. Found just days away from running out of food, it's a story worth of calling a miracle. The community members unanimously credited their survival to one woman. And then it's been shut up, but, well, torn off. Than just any ordinary prepper, she had luckily stocked her bunker for her entire neighborhood. She had a vision of the catastrophe, attributing the outbreak to a divine retribution. All the survivors were quick to agree. The darkness had the foresight. When soldiers tried, wanted to stay, only request lost them, and danger to quarantine refused. Okay. 
So that's probably the start of the scars, I suppose. So that was a more important uh, um, note than you might think. So give me a coke and you'll get that open. Uh, there were vending machines over here. Aha. So the coke is still one. That's why it's an empty can. So it's the fourth row. And then the seventh slot. So four, seven. Or seven, four. We'll try that. Shit. Oh. Needs a combination. Ooh. <laughs> Maybe I should break it up. Ah, there's a note attached to the coke. The, the soda, okay. So the code is 152. Okay, enough hints. If you can't figure the rest out, I'm with the wrong man. Enjoy. 1522. 1522. Uh, 152 and then something else. 152. Ah, okay. So you probably can't, can only use every number once, so... Let's see. So let's reset that. No, no, reset. Um, so one, five, two, and then probably from the outside in, four and three. There we go. Okay, so that was the magic. The combination was uh, going up and down. That was cool. Because there were only two numbers left, but the it went from up to bottom, then back up, and then we should continue the sequence. So that, that kind of made sense. There's a lot of stuff in here. Oh, we're full on racks, but racks, that's not a problem, right? I'm going to make another silencer. I don't have a lot of bullets for the pistol right now, but I mean, I want to save the alcohol for something else. So let's just craft the silencer um, and spread out our resources a little bit. We can grab that. 11 more pills. That is really, really nice. Working towards that, uh, those faster stealth kills. Uh, then that's more explosive stuff. Um, anything else? There's more lockers on the other side. Grabbing whatever we can. This one, this side seems to be a bit more empty. But that seems like more bottles. Bottles are always nice. I feel like there, there should be more bottles. Because bottles, you would find bottles everywhere, plastic bottles. So that doesn't make sense that you only have a few of those. Um, but I'm just quickly going to check my pill count. So 27 and I need 50, I think. No, 60 for faster stealth kills. Okay, okay, makes sense. Okay, but that done, we checked that out. That was a complete little puzzle area. And now we can move further towards this open door. Um, and I think this is not the way we came, right? Yeah, this is the way forward. There might be another... Um... Can we go down here? Yeah, okay, we can definitely... Yeah, there's more where that came from. Shit. Shamblers. Okay, so there's more shamblers over... Oh, there's a lot of infected around here. So they're basically clickers, but we can't... Okay, so they're kind of blocked off at the moment. But they can probably detect us through the area. Oh, fuck! So that's the Shambler. Oh, I can't. Oh, she's gonna spot me, isn't she? We're doing that right in front of that Shambler. So, okay. That was quiet enough, apparently. So that Shambler is over there, and there's no other one. I should probably try and find a way to clear these guys out without too much trouble. I would think they might actually be weak to fire. Although I don't want to waste a Molotov on just that. You know what? Let's just swap to the brick. We know we can actually hit these guys. With a mana strike. And there we go. Like this. Did the other guy already? Oh, fuck. Okay, so they do that when they're dead as well. Oh, 
Oh no 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 that was not supposed to happen. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Okay. I hit him with a Molotov, but that's probably not gonna kill him completely. Or is it? I think the music stopped. I am almost dead. Well, that turned to shit. Ah, okay, yeah, let's heal that up to at least half. And we're almost out of machete. Wait, why is the music going? Why is the music still going? That wasn't good? Okay, let's just craft. Can we do that again? Oh. I can't upgrade the machete for some reason. Huh. Okay, so you can't do that again. That is interesting. Um, do these guys drop anything? No. But it seems like Molotovs are a one-hit kill on these guys, so that's... Good thing to note, so if we can group them together, then we can kill them in one go. But, aside from that, I need to take a look. And also, if they die, they actually... Well, disperse that same cloud, so... Definitely not a good idea to just... Keep lingering on their corpses when you, once you do that. And even though we were pretty far away from anything else... Seems like we did trigger the uh, other batch anyway. Should probably make another uh, trap mine, yeah. There we go, because we're gathering more explosive stuff over here. That was almost a full batch. Okay, so I found a few things. Nothing to write home about, but two more bullets for the revolver. And a closed off door. So let's just bam that. Bam that. And another one. There we go. Probably an, another horror-filled room. There. But how would you... I mean, we don't know what's in front of us. Oh, but I do see daylight. That is good. What the hell happened here? I'm gonna say some kind of train crash. Thanks, Sherlock. Yeah, do you know that was a very smart remark there. Um, I'm checking out every square inch of this place, but it uh, seems like the game wants us to go inside of the train itself. And indeed, some sort of train crash, so... I mean, even during an infection, what would cause this? Maybe one of the people got infected while on the train? That seems... old. Jesus. I wonder how long they kept these running past outbreak day. No this idea. Up we go then. There we go. Up we go. Dina? Yeah. Coming. Hopefully we don't run into the Washington Liberation Front again. Mm, I could go down there, but it doesn't seem like there's anything down there worth our salt. Although, we could probably go... Yeah, I think we can... Oh, wait a second. There's a note here. For Jules again. Okay. So that continues that story a little bit, I suppose. Hi Jules, I'm still holding out hope that you're coming. It's unbelievable. The amount of infected down here. I'm starting to admire Zachary. He's a solid fighter in close quarters and he can hear anything creeping around in the dark. I swear he's like a bat. Also he prays for his ailing father every night and he joins me in prayer for the ones I love and miss, especially you. This phrase Zachary keeps saying, may she guide you. It's what jumps to my mind every time I wonder what's up with you. Maybe there is something greater, someone greater watching over us. I'm starting to sound like a religious nut, aren't I? So may she guide you, Jules. Travel fast, travel safe, grey. So that is the mantra, yeah, it's marked as uh, one of the scar symbols as well. Of the scars, may she guide you. There's a woman... Um, that was a weird noise. There's a woman in charge of the scars, with a scar in her face. And, yeah, they seem to be worshipping her pretty intensely. I think we're almost out of the subway station. There's some nice artwork on the walls. Looks a bit Andy Warhol-ish. Might even be him. I am not sure. Uh, so that's where we can go up. Again, there's a few phones over here, but... Maybe we can get up there. Yeah, but there's something over here as well, Dina. I can crawl in here, so that must have a reason. Aside from horrible monstrosities that are probably ready to claw my eyes out. 
But we do got a little bit of rags. And that's basically it. And my cat is suddenly going crazy for some reason. He must have seen something outside. Ah, <laughs> uh, this is not the time. There we go. Okay. Okay. A one, two, three. Ups a daisy. <laughs> And then the other way around. Ooh, there's actually... She can probably push that box. What you got? I mean... Otherwise she just pulls me up, so... This seems like a stretch. Okay. Let's rally. We're almost out. Lead on. There's rifle ammo in this train. I mean, I'm at... Eight or seven rifle bullets at the moment, so that's going to be nice. If only I could make a silencer on the for the the bolt action rifle, that would be nice, because that would be a great sniping weapon from afar. That would be. Oh, thanks for the. Thanks for the heart attack and clickers. Okay, I'm pressing square. Ah, uh, she's gonna, she's gonna get infected now. Ellie, your mask. Here, we can share mine. No, 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 no! Don't take it back. Stop, stop, Ellie, stop. What? No, Ellie, no. Stop. I'm not infected. I'm immune. I'm not coughing. Do you see? Oh, we're gonna have to wake up. Yes, let's fucking go. Go. I mean, she never listened to us. Oh, go, 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 yeah, right, definitely right. Come on. Let's crawl over that. Oh, that's gonna drop down. That's gonna drop down from the heat. Nope. Ooh. I got the hit there. That was a sneaky hit. Oh! Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. What the hell just happened? Whoosh. Wow, that was a nice shot, Dina. by the way. Holy crap. I didn't even hear the gunshot with all the noise. <laughs> oh, we're gonna get ambushed by something else, aren't we? Hey. What do you say we rest in that theater? Oh. Oh, this is nice. Yeah, the noise of the screaming infected in the background. Ooh, that that literally got me tensed up. That was a great way to show, or to prove to Dina that the Ellie wasn't, can't be infected, that she's immune. But Dina never believed her, because we told her that already. Let's hope there's nobody in there. Oh wow, this doesn't look creepy at all. Okay, we're good. There we go. And it's time to talk, I would say. Come on, girls. It's time for a little heart to heart, I think. You want to tell me what's going on with you? What's going on with me? Ellie, I just saw you breathe spores. I told you. I'm immune. Okay, you're immune? Come on. I was bitten a long time ago. What the fuck are you talking about? I was bitten and nothing happened. The chemical burn.
Maria and Tommy and Joel are the only ones who know. Knew. Now you know. I can't get you infected if that's what you're worried about. I can't make you immune either. Say something. Really? I think I'm pregnant. There we go. Called that as well. What? The vomit. Don't worry, it's not yours. <laughs> <laughs> what do we? What are we supposed to do now? Nothing. I just need to rest for a second. Are you fucking kidding me? How long have you known? It was late a few weeks ago. A few weeks? We could have... We could have still turned back. I didn't know... I wasn't sure, okay? I didn't want to be a burden. Well, you're a burden now, aren't you? Oh, Eddie, calm down. Make sure this place is secure. I think you need to talk to her, Ellie. You just rest. Whew. Wow. That was a pretty heavy scene. Um, we're gonna leave it at that for now, for today. So, uh, thank you guys enormously for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this app. Oh, look at that. She's curled up in a ball already. Ali, you're a bit too harsh, I think, at the moment. By the way, before we go, I wanted to talk... Because that brought up an interesting point. So the only people who know that Ali is immune are, right now, Dina, Tommy, and Maria. But what's even more important, the very first thing we got in this game was Joel confessing to Tommy what he had done what he had done at the Firefly base. So the fact that they could make a cure, but they never really tried, because, of course, Joel stopped the surgeons from killing Ellie. Ellie doesn't know that. Ellie thinks that there just isn't a way to make the cure. That's why Joel had to tell Tommy at the beginning of the game, because otherwise there wouldn't be nobody who would know the truth. Now Tommy knows, so that's going to be important later on, I suppose. And I'm going to assume Tommy must have told Maria. Although it would be weird that Maria then would take the risk to send Ellie out. So it, in that, it might make sense that Tommy didn't actually tell his own wife. So that would make Tommy the only one who knows about what happened, what really happened to the Fireflies. Um, so that's going to come up later in the story. I'm pretty sure about that. But as I said, I'm going to take a little break. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I'm going to try and give as much, discuss it as much as I possibly can while we're going through it, because it's, it's, it's a really interesting take on the story, even though, as I said before, the gameplay is, is pretty similar with a few extra tools. Um, I'm really, really into the, the story and the characters right now. So thank you guys enormously for watching again, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of The Last of Us Part 2. Goodbye. Yeah,